Who doesn't love a unique way to cook some of your favorite foods? And while we all love a classic stovetop grilled cheese, the question has always rang in my head, how can this be more fun? And I think I found the answer. And that's why we're breaking out the waffle iron to ask a new question, will it waffle? And we're not stopping with a simple grilled cheese. We're asking it of some of our favorite foods from every taste palette. We yes, recently did we this are. with cookies. We did, and it turned out amazing. So will it waffle? Yeah, we're gonna find out today, aren't we? And we're yes. gonna start off with some grilled cheese, grilled cheese using the butter that we actually recently made. I know, and this is um, this particular one is the compound butter we made that is sage, sage thyme, and salt. Okay. And I think that goes great with a grilled cheese I sandwich, know, it's right? such a good idea. These Those compound butters, they're they really the way to go. Yep. So we're just using bread, butter, and cheese, but I think like, honestly, any sandwich would probably work this way. That's I grilled. think so too. I mean, it's basically a panini yeah, at this point, but right. we're doing but it. But if you have a waffle iron at home, yeah. then and here you go. More of a waffle setting. While you do that, I'll yeah. get this next one started. So we're also trying uh, cinnamon rolls and biscuits. So the bis I'm gonna start with the biscuit because it took a little longer to cook. Now I did something different with this. Let's okay. hear it. So I first of all, you loved the popping of that, but we were oh, afraid we yeah. weren't going to be able to get it, so we had to do it ahead of time. <laughs> Check that out on social media if you want to see me scared of this can <laughs> of biscuits, which definitely happened. Okay, so I thought it would be fun if the biscuit had a secret surprise inside. You mentioned actually when we were talking about this that you could make a pizza or something by yeah. putting the pizza ingredients. Right, a little pizza pocket. But I kind of thought I really like my biscuits with jam, like jelly and butter. Okay, so yeah. I'm going to put a little jam pocket in it. So it's it's going to be like a pastry. This is a true. We're trying it out. Yeah, we're trying it for you. Okay, you're gonna get that going? I'm gonna put it in. Okay. Here we go. Oh boy, I might need to do a little flip. So, and then I'm gonna um, pinch the edges of my biscuit together so that the jelly hopefully doesn't come out. Okay? Okay. Okay, how's that? I'm gonna press it down so I can get Mickey's face. Oh yeah, Mickey. Here. That We stole that one from Fox. It might be a little half. Okay, so then I'm just gonna put my biscuit right there and then I'm going to take, let's see, I bet I can make two cinnamon rolls. I'm going to do two cinnamon rolls. And the key here is to not put too much filling in the biscuit. Yeah. yeah. And then we're just going to get that started. Now, in the spirit of will it waffle. This is the one I am the most excited for. This is the one I'm the least, I guess, confident, confident about. in. Okay, so this we're is the one we might have to really learn to see one. if it works. And I thought, could you waffle just an egg? I think you can. Let's try it. I feel excited. Okay. As long as you don't get any shell in there. Okay. Ooh. Let's see. Here we go. Will it waffle? <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, I don't know. The cookie, that was kind of, that one's seen a little bit more. I've yeah. seen the cinnamon roll before, but we're going to try and stretch it a little bit I'm here. I'm all about it. Now, how's that looking? It's looking great. Okay. Since we longer. did pre-prepare this, what do you say we open these up and taste these? I think we need to. Okay, well, so we'll also see how cooked they got. They look great on the outside. Let's see if the jelly surprise worked. I didn't put very much in because I was really worried it would explode. Yeah, make a mess. It looks really good, though. Oh, okay. Oh, I can't see much jelly. I think the jelly disappeared out Let's of there. Let's see if you can taste it. Is this a plain biscuit? Yeah, <laughs> maybe. Cheers. I can still taste the jelly, and it's a good biscuit. More jelly. More jelly. Biscuit's great. Here. <laughs> Pour a little oh, back Oh, thank in. you. Thank you. It, it does create a nice little pocket. It does. Let's see if I can get the jelly out here. The I'll cut the part. cinnamon roll. The, the biscuit tastes great, though. The biscuit's it, really good. It cooked really well. We've talked. Also, it was fairly quick. We've talked. Yeah. So that's a good point. It took about ten minutes, mm -hmm. and that's not bad. Well, and let's see. How's that? Oh, I think it's looking good. Okay, okay. these ones. Let's cut. This. All right. How's the bottom side? Oh yes. Yeah. Hot, but yes. All right, we're going to move this over here. Shall Look we, um, before we cut into the grilled cheese, shall we start with the oh, yeah. cinnamon roll? Yeah, we'll start with the sweet. Yeah. Here we go. This is like you could have breakfast at your desk every day. And you can see Mickey's face. Mmm. This is perfectly cooked. The cinnamon roll is perfect. I don't know perfect. what it is with the sweets here because when we did the... Pile that there. When we did the cookie, the cookie was also amazing. It was really good. You know what I love about this cinnamon roll is that you know how sometimes when you bake them the outer the outer roll yeah. is like too hard yep this yep. is all perfectly it's doughy. totally sweet okay look at this we have mickey on our grilled cheese i can't believe it <laughs> want to so cut proud. that one 
We'll cut this one and give it a taste. Out. Should we check on our egg? I don't know. I'm nervous. I'm a little nervous, too. I can't open it. <laughs> this little one gets hotter than you would think. Yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, it's no. It's stuck together. Well, this is a <laughs> great example of will it waffle. <laughs> okay. All right. It will waffle. Here's our lesson. Here's our lesson. We just needed to add a little bit more cooking spray. We had some oil on it. Not enough, I guess. It's not looking terrible. But it will waffle. Let me okay. see. You Let grab this. this. I think we can get it out. Oh, no, we can't. We can't get it out. <laughs> this baby is Unplug it. <laughs> but the great right. cheese is, is fantastic. It? Oh, my God. What do you think? The butter is the best part. Mm -hmm. The Perfectly seasoned butter. Grilled. Mm -hmm. And, and a Mickey. Fun treat. And that's actually, like, I hadn't really thought of it, but my fox loves Mickey so much. Yeah. And I've made it's waffles in It's such an here. easy idea, too. It's not a lot of dishes. Plug it in. Do it. You're done. And you have to flip it? Yeah. No. And it's perfectly grilled on both What's sides once favorite? again. Yeah. Well, it was going to be the egg because I was so <laughs> excited to see how it was going to turn out. Favorite's probably the cinnamon roll. Mm -hmm. I love, though, that you can do the waffle irons that have a pattern built into them with the grilled cheese. That's a fun idea that I've never thought of. The egg almost worked. Well, we did just get a tip from Khalil that he saw somebody make sushi. Yeah. Well, well, it wasn't necessarily sushi. It was, well, it was like, like a rice bowl. A rice, but in the... Yeah. I, I'm all for Should it. Should we try Will It Waffle with I that love next? little rice bowls. That, and I am, I'm set on making a pizza. I just need to do maybe a little bit of research to yeah. make sure. Because I think we might have a mess. But a Mickey pizza. Can Mickey you imagine? Pizza? Fox would love it. Okay, Fox I can't decide what it. to eat next. I'm going with the grilled cheese. All right, we're going to have to work on getting this egg out. We'll work on the eggs. <laughs> we'll be right back after the break. <laughs> 